Hi everyone, I just read the new Century miniseries and I have some thoughts. Okay, so the main character, Mallory Gibbs, has cerebral palsy like I do, but her, um, her disability isn't consistent. Sometimes they have her walking around with no problem because of her sentry powers. Now, I'm going to be blunt. Well, I'm always blunt, but I'm going to be extra blunt right now. Cerebral palsy does not work like that. If she could, we don't see her walking before she has her sentry powers. And, um, if you have powers and can't walk, that's not going to fix it. That's not how the brain works. They need to, um, next time they have her, um, in a comic, I'm not going to spoil what happens because I think people should read it. It's, it's not the greatest comic ever written, but for a character with CP, it's a fairly good representation. I mean, it's, it's very inconsistent. Like I said, she's, sometimes she's flying and she's fine. Like she could bear, she barely has any, um, problems. And other times she has a hand like this. And I'm going to show you something. When you have a hand like this and you go to lift something up, you're not going to be able to do it. And they have her do it twice in the book. Well, one time they have her fail, and then the other time she's perfectly okay with it. And that's not how it works. She's going to know that her hand can't um, hold this uh, object that she fails to hold and other she has a spasm at just the right moment and as somebody who takes a lot of muscle relaxers every single day to control her spasms I'm going to tell you something else if you're stressed out you're going to spasm a lot more so that also isn't inconsistent but it's comics, okay? But it still kind of irked me a little. I really, um, really enjoyed the book, but it seems a little ham-fisted. They kind of telegraph early on that she's going to be the hero. And it kind of bothered me because her hand, like I said, cerebral palsy doesn't go away because you have powers. And at the end, they show her in the chair again. Um, how can you be walking in one issue and then in the next issue, you're in the chair? They need to explain that she gets tired or something because it was really, really bothering me. I know, I know. Handicapped person spoils, spoil the book a little, but it it's just a nitpicky, irksome thing that I had going on. Okay, goodbye everyone. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.